We got to do it like this. Tricky, tricky. Tricky, tricky. Hmm. Actually, how are we going to do pink now? Hmm. Because this is too far over. I got to move that. Actually, I don't know how to do that. Like, this is the only way to get the yellow one done. But if I move this over, it's going to touch. If I move blue, it's going to touch. Hmm. Kind of messed up here. Yeah, that's what I thought. If, if I move green... pink over here maybe I don't know this will help me nope that's not gonna help me crap this is definitely tricky move the purple out from under the blue but it once I move it it's gonna touch this so that's not gonna do me much good sucks move the purple out from under the blue this one but I'm not sure how this helps so f so first get the yellow out and then move the purple but I what do you mean get it out I, if I get it out it's gonna fall it's got to go sliding across. Because this yellow one here is stuck. So this yellow one has to slide across. We need to build a ramp for it. So we have no choice. This blue one has to go here. There is no choice. Now we have the options. We can do pink or green. And this is what gets me stuck. Because right now this pink I mean we could really move this anywhere it doesn't really matter um. yeah see, this is this is screwed though I don't know how to do this Just move this over here. But I don't see how this helps me. Yeah, see, that's no good either. Oh, wow. Okay. I don't think this is going to work, but whatever. Yeah, I've got the yellows done. So, yeah, these pinks have got two squares between them. This is useless. Green can't go this way. The only answer is to put blue over here. And then to put pink here. And then we just put green there. Yellow goes here. And I think, oh, it can only go that way. I don't see how this is gonna, I don't know how to deal with this gap here. Because if I slide this over, it's gonna knock these two out, but.
Holy Christ. <laughs> In a hand basket. I mean, we could just move green here and that won't do anything. I don't think that's the right move though. See, this is the problem, right? But if I move this first, that's gonna leave me with... Hmm. Once I move either one of these, they're gonna touch, and that's gonna be bad. Yeah, even this doesn't work, because once this falls, then the green's gonna activate here. I fell asleep on the couch. That's okay, cat. We're doing puzzles and mannequins, and it's all good. I, I feel like there's, there's only one solution here for this one. What I'm struggling with is I can't quite figure out what to do with this pink one. This is the one that's driving me crazy. It's this freaking pink shirt with a heart on it. We are still trying to solve the mystery. We know it's a mask. And we know it's causing him to have split personality. And he's controlling mannequins. Do the mannequins have cousins like the weeping? Aunt? I think they're interrelated, cat. I think so. I think you're on to something. See, the thing is, like, these can only go left or right, so this is kind of the problem we face. Okay. They get just crazy. Uh, drink some wine, it'll help you. I think you're right, Elena. Take a deep slug, you know? Where are we? Holy shoot. <laughs> we gotta do this three, no, four times or three times? Four freaking times. Wow. So it actually wants me to move that first. Huh, check that out. Like, this is all I really need. So, we need to move green, blue, yellow, pink. Okay. I must ask for a mandatory skip. Oh, we already had one earlier. It was one of those puzzles where you pick up two pieces at once. And I probably was f having fun with it. You know, air quotes, fun. For a good 10, 15 minutes. Um, <laughs> so, yeah. Um, I think this one's fine. Because this one's just following the instructions here. So yellow and then blue, blue. Yellow. Hey, wait, where's the blue go? That way. So blue and then blue. Okay. I don't know what's going on here though. Fun is fine. It totally is. It's the finest of funs. So this logic is just ridiculous. Blue, pink, pink, pink. So blue comes to an end, and then we're moving basically all the pinks over there. Huh. All right. I'm still not sure I understand how this is going to work. Oh, I see. It drops right in the middle. Oh, jeez. That makes more sense now. See, we can have pink drop right in the middle. Oh, my God. <laughs> we got to do it again. Woo! 
Woohoo! Oh, look at this freaking mess. Holy crap. Oh my god. Look at this thing. How in the hell are we supposed to do this? This is stuck over here, so... <laughs> but this thing is stuck down there. Oh, I am... Gee. The slots above you, the green slots, tell you how many times you have completed? Yeah, okay, up here. This is gonna take... Because then this must mean... If you go back to the solution, then... There's like freaking 27 moves to get this one done. <laughs> wow. Blue, yellow, pink, no. Oh my god. That's crazy. Crazy, crazy, crazy. So then, like, how, how, like, I don't understand how pink, how the hell does pink get out of here? <laughs> I don't understand how this could even get out of here. <laughs> this makes no sense. Oh, 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 yeah, 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 okay, there's two of them. Okay, okay, actually, what am I trying, I'm trying to get them all done at the same time, that's ridiculous. Okay, this is fine, this is fine. Um, oh, maybe it's not. Oh, I think I screwed it up. I think we gotta get this this thing over first. There we go. And then these two yellows can touch. These two pinks can touch. I think we gotta get that over and then we'll get this one done and then we have it touch. And then this can touch. This one's actually relatively straightforward, to be honest. So obviously these can touch. So wow, blue has really got to get down there. So I guess we'll get blue out of the way. Yellow can touch. Pink, this is actually a lot easier than the last round. It's funny how the third round is easy. Yay! <laughs> to the roof! Did he just turn the dude into a freaking mannequin? It's the police squad, Detective Griffinson. This one is serious. He just turned it into a freaking mannequin. We need darts. We don't got any darts. I bet there's something useful in here, but I need to find the missing pieces. Finally, it's hard to come to... Oh, we're not quite ready for it. Oh, okay. Soon, though. Soonish. How can I stop them without hurting them? Oh, it's like on their face, like like the mass movie. Wow. Scroll? No. Plier. So we got to figure out what the plier is going to be doing. Back to the office. Oh, the mannequins were alive beforehand. Who would have guessed it? Yeah, I didn't think... I don't know if the man... Like, no, because the mannequins kind of fall into pieces? I Actually, I'm kind of confused now how these mannequins work. How do these mannequins work? This must be a sleeping or something. Yeah, that's what I figured. We're going to drug them. I just think the guy, the bad guy, uses a special power that um, lets him, like, put a mask on them or something. So we now have a key. This is probably where we're going to get those. 
Oh, it's a bird. I thought we were going to get darts here. Not quite ready for that. This kind of reminds me of Stray Soul's Dollhouse Story. Really? That's on my list to replay again, by the way. Okay, so we've got the second half of this thing here. All of the medical stuffs. Thermos... Thermometers? Hey, we got needles, darts, whatever. Fill her up. It's Pinkle and it's juicy. He's just standing there while we're digging through this. Hey buddy, would you like to eat a scroll for breakfast? We finally arrived to the end of our game. Did you have fun, Rick? I have. I've been watching you ever since the moment I hired you. But I'm tired of playing cops and robbers, Rick. It's time for you to die. Quick, a puzzle! Find a weapon! <laughs> that one just fell apart. All of these are weapons. A soccer ball? <laughs> I love it. The bad weapons just disintegrate in her hands. A ladder's a weapon. Find a place to hide. Look at that. We're just finding all of the hammers we need. <laughs> oh my god. This is great. Wait, is it timed? I hope not. A running man. Oh, the things are spinning too. Or some of them are spinning. It's very action y. Throw everything! And a fire extinguisher! <laughs> it's not like a bang. Oh god, I got a gun now! Ah, shoot him! Again! Again! Oh. Oh, jeez. <laughs> what are we shooting? Spray and pray. Spray and pray. This is great. Poke his eyes out. Yeah, get in there. Oh, ouch. Oh, he's punching me. And in the eyes again. Thanks, Detective. I'm not sure what happened, but I am ready to help out if you need backup. You really helped us out. You're kind of late to the party there, my dear. <laughs> Look at this. Rick Rogers, why must you do this the hard way? Do you want wealth, luck, power? The mask can give all that and more. Break it, break it. No! No thanks, I'm good. Oh, you're just gonna store it in a case like that? Okay, that was cool. <laughs> Yay! I hope you enjoyed that paranormal file. That's right, I'm putting a heavy P in the para. Paranormal files. It should be paranormal piles. Get all. Paranormal Files, number two. Oh, he's watering his garden. How did she... How is she going to do her report to the police? She is a security guard. I, 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 she was just hired and she really, really needs that job, Cat. She was just like, oh, I really... Oh, he's waving at us now. Okay, I feel like these are the best credits I've ever seen. He's waving at us. He's watering his plants. Oh, look, he's got a tambourine, too. <laughs> Wow. So yes, that was Paranormal Files number two. 
I still have to play three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And I hear there's a tenth, a new one. So I am definitely gonna do that. I, I'm loving the quirkiness of it. Uh, it's definitely right up my alley. Hopefully you folks had a good time to it. <laughs> I'm just putting on the mask now. Seriously, these are the best credits I've ever seen in a Hidden Object game. Too much fun. I listened to a band named Hollywood Undead. It's like one of the masks. Ah. I think it's a bad idea to keep that. I think he should have broke it too. Yeah, I hear, I hear you. So yes, uh, this game was courtesy of Elephant Games. They actually provided me access to it so I could share it with all of you today. And uh, yeah, we've got more. I've got so much more to go through um, and I'm happy to share it all with you. Mr. Tambourine Man. Rick Rogers. Paranormal Files. <laughs> Holy cow. If he broke the mask, will the ghost be released? That is a great question. So that is the main game. Tune in for the bonus chapter real soon.